Hello guys, today I'm going to be teaching you how to use set in Apex and uh, okay, let's go into it. let's dive into it. So we have uh, the previous video done list. If you have not watched the previous video, you can go back to you can go back to my um, videos and check for the previous video for list. So we are going to be doing set. So to do set, you can write set in this way as well. Just want to copy this and paste it. Okay. And paste it here. Okay, let me paste it here. This is here, so I'm going to change this to set, set, and uh, you know, set. The thing is about set is that set removes duplicate. If I have two pita in this uh, value, yeah. <coughs> Set is going to remove one beta and leave one. And set arrange the values in alphabetical order. And also set doesn't have index because it arranges it in alphabetical order. So if you like, try to say index dot uh, index. We are trying to put the index and the value. You'll not be able to tell where it is going to put it because it doesn't use index. So let's do an example. So, I mean, so I'm going to execute this okay we are going to change this one to let's change this to name two and name one let's try and execute it again So the world only okay for us to see a result let us add the system dot debug so let's copy this one and paste it here Name and send the log and one. So rise the keys. The log only. So we have it. This is for list. David, Steve, Angel, and Peter. And this is for set. Angel. David, Peter, and Steve. So the list did not arrange it, but the set arranged it in alphabetic order. So, and set doesn't allow duplicate values. So if we go into the system, I'm going to the, and I had another Peter here. Well, let me add Steve. I add Steve. I like it. The board. So, as you can see, see for 
you can still see Steve. You cannot see, you can only see one Steve here Angel, David, Peter, and Steve. But if we had Steve in the list, we are going to see two Steve. So let's do that. All right. Let me show you. Yeah, and another Steve here. And I highlight it. So in the list we have two Steve, but in the set we have one Steve. So let's go into the developer guide so we can see some functions to use. So we are going to check the developer guides. So I'll search for sets of class. Yeah. So we have the set class, we have the method, the hard, the hard element that we use in the list element is also working for set. We can use this one. So we are going to use this one, this hard element. Let's go into our developer console and uh, we open our Linux window. So, we are going to be using this one, this app. We won't be able to use this one because it does not support index, which is set does not support index. So, we'll be using this. Let me copy this. Copy this and I will paste it here. So I'm going to see name one because we've changed the name and the system dot work name one. So I'm going to highlight it to this set. So let me highlight it here and there is cute. Open it, the bug only. Now we can see another thing here David, John, when we added Ta and uh, Steve. So that's pretty much how to use a uh, set. If you want to know how to use the rest of the method, you can just come here and uh, you know start working on it so you can subscribe to my channel if you want to know more of apex and if you have any comments if you have any comments you can put it in the comment comment section